Hey everybody, Jack Barnwell here on beautiful Mackinac Island. It is a stunning early summer day here. Thought we'd take you through one of my favorite gardens here, the Carriage House Gardens at the Hotel Iroquois. We got them all planted up a couple weeks ago. They're starting to fill in and look stunning, so let's check them out. All right, so it is a gorgeous sunny day here on the island. The island is starting to come to life with a, a beautiful sunny summer day here today. And we wanted to take a moment to walk you down through one of my favorite gardens, if we can get a little break in the crowds here. Uh, we got this planted all up a couple of weeks ago. As you can see, it's still very early summer. The crab apples are still flowering. This is a uh, red jade crab apple, a really old, gorgeous specimen here. But uh, like I said, we're at the Hotel Iroquois. The gardens are all planted up and looking stunning. This walkway right here, I would say is probably about 80% annual flowers. And uh, it changes every single year. So every year we change up the color scheme and the concept in here. We've got a lot of really, really beautiful plants, but this is known as a Proven Winners Signature Garden. And it's the first Proven Winners Signature Garden in the country. So all of these plants are proven winners, including lemon coral sedum, surefire begonias, meteor showers verbena. I could go on and on and on. It's a really stunning garden to come and see. We've also got some really neat features in here, like this beautiful fountain. This was custom made for the Iroquois Hotel. Notice the little turtle on top, and it's just barely trickling out a little bit of water and it's got just a little bit of sound to it. It's really, really pretty, especially with some lights on it at night. This walkway, obviously we're in the middle of the day and it's bright and it's sunny and it's beautiful, but underneath this Louisa crab apple tree, we have a really nice shade bed here with some of these beautiful begonias that look absolutely stunning. Look at that, look at that yellow, some of these coleus colors are really, really amazing. And then, a, you know, very, very close by, there's really sunny pockets where we've got some bright sun, bright colors, a lot of sun patients and stuff that are, that are coming on, some really cool hydrangeas. But we'll keep on walking through. Here's the entry to the Carriage House Dining Room, which is uh, probably the best dining room, the best food on Mackinac Island by far. Um, and of course, the location is absolutely amazing. It's right on the water. Um, every little corner and every little pocket is planted up. This year, because we had uh, very, very high water, the Great Lakes are really high this year, we had to do a lot of work, a lot of renovation and kind of retrofit of the, the landscape back here to deal with the really high water and incredible waves and storms that we were getting. In fact, when I showed up here this spring, to dive into Mackinac Island projects and stuff. This whole backyard, uh, back lawn area was about a foot to a foot and a half deep in gravel. There was incredible amounts of debris. All of this, most of this brick was tore up and ripped apart because of the big, big crashing waves. And we had to put this massive amount of uh, uh, boulder work out there on the break wall to increase the height and the size of the, the, uh, the break wall and protect. You can't tell today because it's such a stunning, perfect day here on the island. But when the east wind blows, those waves will roll right through here and right over this break wall. So this garden completely changed this year into this really, really cool rock garden. Uh, we've got some really neat, this was just planted like a week ago, um, but we've got some creeping thyme, Elijah blue grasses there, some daisies, hardy geraniums, little uh, scotch and iris moss and sedums and stuff. But this garden is designed to basically take uh, the storms and huge amounts of water that wash over here. That's why it's a, you know, just a stone and gravel mulch with all these boulders woven in to break up those waves that are going to come through here. So this bed used to be a big, colorful, stunning annual planting of flowers. We could not do that anymore because of the, the height of the water and these storms that come through here. So we changed up the look of this bed. I'm really excited about it. I think it's a really cool look along here. 
And then in the, in the lawn itself, we still have a lot of beautiful annual color. As you can see, it's lunchtime, so there's a lot of people out here enjoying lunch right on the water, having a mimosa, maybe a Bloody Mary or two. Uh, I wouldn't mind joining them, uh, but I've got a lot of work to do today. My whole crew is working, planting trees, and continuing to make Mackinac Island an absolutely beautiful place for all of you to come up and visit and see us here at the Hotel Iroquois and Mackinac in general. We'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.